this you guys this is the ds x e tense it's based in paris What's up guys, it's Supercar Blondie. Welcome to my channel. If you haven't yet subscribed, hit that button right now. This is where you get to see the craziest cars, right? DS, you guys, is the premium car brand from the PSA group. Let me take you through this one. The first thing you might notice is that it's asymmetrical. Have you ever seen a car like this before? Personally, I've never seen anything like it. The left side looks nothing like the right side. It's mad. It's absolutely incredible. Let me explain why this is. There is two sides to this car for a very, very good reason. They're looking to the future. Now, when you look at cars in the future, a lot of brands are focusing on autonomy, but what they've recognized is that not everyone wants to just be driven around in future. There are some, like you and me, who still want to drive, right? So this side of the car is about driving yourself around okay so this is like the pure emotion side of the car the wind in your hair you can see there's no roof here so it's about power performance exhilaration that's this side and this is how the door opens it's like a butterfly door on this side and then come around the front this side here is all about autonomous driving. So this side is like a little cocoon where you sit in and be driven around. And this is a gullwing door, a completely different door from the other side. Honestly, this is awesome. What do you think so far? Take a look at this. This is a, a, a glass floor here, so you can see all the way through. And then this is a floating passenger seat. Take a look at that. That is cool. So if you're sitting here, you're literally surrounded by the road beneath you. <laughs> That's crazy, you guys. So if you want to be driven around, you can be. This car is driverless. So you can be sitting in this little cocoon with you and a mate if you want, or you can have someone else drive you. I've been here for maybe like 30 minutes. Every time, we're actually in an area where there are tourist buses. <laughs> They're offloading people here in the center of London. And I think like literally they stay around for about 20 to 30 minutes in this spot, just taking pictures of the cars. Look at this. Look at all these people. They, it, it, it really draws a crowd, this car, because it's so unique. I mean, what car looks like this? All right, okay, let me show you what's in here. Look, it's a little coffee machine. Take this out, have your little coffee. So this side is all about like relaxation, comfort, the best materials. The air is scented. So when the air is fed through into this cabin, you you can put in a particular scent that you like. This is a massage chair as well. You can see the feathers here on the side. You see this little diamond detailing. Diamonds are like a, a brand feature of DS. So you'll see diamonds all the way through this car here as well and on the tail lights. They have feathers here behind the seat as well. Now, you might ask, what's the deal with the feathers? DS, as I said, is a brand based in Paris. Paris is a fashion capital of the world and they want to bring in like the haute couture, high fashion elements of Paris as a city into this car as well. So they've got the really high quality wood here and the leather materials. They've got the speakers integrated into the wood, this beautiful uh, watch here in the front and then all the highest like quality materials, including the feathers. This side is all about autonomous mode, uh, if you don't want to, head to the driver's side, which is what we're about to do now. Take this baby for a bit of a drive. Pop that back in. All right, around to the driver's side. I just think this is so cool. Like you could cut this car in half and this would look like a car in itself, right? 
because you've kind of got the 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 front grille here and then you've got lights that take up this entire side one of the things ds automobiles concentrates on is this diamond uh tail light here or diamond lights oh here we go oh look at this i didn't get to see this before because i was driving oh it's awesome all the way along city of lights paris one of the things they want to concentrate on is lights in all their cars so we're going to see some of the coolest lights in their production cars coming out in the next few years all right driver's side where we like it best right <laughs> the craziest thing is you guys this car is completely road legal it is the craziest looking car you would never expect to be able to actually take this out on the streets of London, which is what we're about to do right now. All right. Ooh. Okay. If it starts raining, I'm literally going to have to drive around with an umbrella. <laughs> it is starting to like spit a little bit, so we'll just get it. We'll get a. We'll get an umbrella in the. Another in on the action. The there you go. Here we go. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, this is going to be interesting. Mary Poppins! <laughs> oh my goodness! Wow, okay. This will be interesting. What you should have is a little like umbrella holder in the car. If it does start to rain, literally I'm going to be... I'm just going to tuck this into my jacket like this. <laughs> there we go. There we go! Done! And now I can drive. I've got to move the seat forward. There's a button here. we go okay this is how you start the car foot on the brake all right and there's a little button right here press that these lights come on now it's on look you've got a little green light there now you've got to see the lights at the front check this out Looks amazing, right? All right, we're ready. Are you ready? I'm gonna take it for a drive. We're heading out. This is how you put it in gear. Just with this little button, hold that down and it will go into drive and then it's just on the gas. Let's hope it doesn't rain. That's the name of the team. This car has the same electric technology, or it's based on the same electric technology as the Formula E team that is currently the world champions. You know those bikes where one guy's like riding the bike and then it has like a little side compartment? It kind of feels like that, but on an elevated level. I know that sounds really weird to say, but just having this kind of like side compartment next to you feels 
like nothing I've ever experienced before and that's really the only thing that I can compare it to. Can you let me through? Thank you, appreciate it. Cheers, mate. All right. Oh, that was awesome. What I love is that if you want this kind of exhilarating wind in your hair feel, you can get it. But if it's rainy and cold outside, you can kind of cocoon yourself in that section of the car. So in one car, you've got two completely different experiences. That is awesome. Look at this. Just look at the crowd it draws. This is crazy. Ooh, just got to leave. Tuck that in. Yeah, this is my little souvenir as I drive around London. Now, we're going to go pick up one of my mates, Casper. He lives here in London. You guys, if you don't follow him yet on YouTube, go check out his handle. It's in the description below. And because I want to be able to get an experience in both sides, right? So I'm going to be in the driver's side, talk to you about how that feels. Casper is going to go into the silent cocoon right next to me. And he's going to get like the whole experience of being driven around in this beauty. What I think is cool about this is, you know, when you think of beauty, for a long time, it's kind of been said that a symmetrical face is a beautiful face, right? So you can kind of say the same thing maybe about a car, but they're trying to challenge the concept, the traditional concept of beauty being symmetrical with a completely asymmetrical car. And it is beautiful. They've done it. So my mate Casper is just inside, so I'm gonna run in and grab him and show him the car for the very first time. All right. This is just my, is this uh, my townhouse. Uh, it's just, yeah. Is this just like a holiday home? Yeah, you don't, you don't, want to, don't look at that. Don't look at that. <laughs> you have your other real house, which is much, much bigger. Yeah, no, I mean, this right? is just, you know, this is basically my flat. In, yeah, because I looked at it, I was a bit disappointed. Like, right, what is this? What place? is Seriously? this? Like? Oh, <laughs> look at this. My gosh. Yeah. I've never seen a car with. Uh, Thing like this on it. Uh, yeah. Oh, you're even impressed by the car. <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah, wow, we can all go home now. I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah. So, is all this right. for me? Like, so basically, what I want to are do you it is, to me? I wish. I think this car would probably be worth like, tw like twenty to forty million dollars. That's nearly as much as my flat. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just trade it in? <laughs> basically, this is a one-off. Uh, this is a concept car made for 2035 by DS Automobiles. So they're like a new car company, been around for a couple of years. And they're known for their lights. See the light designs yeah, yeah, yeah. just underneath the cover already looks mad crazy. Wow. So what we're going to do is uncover the car. You may as well just see it, right? Yeah, Let's just I go for it, it yeah. right? And Are I'll, you going to do it for me? Yeah. Cool. So you can stand back and get the, the whole... Experience. Yeah, exactly. I have to make some... Oh, <laughs> this is like Sweet 16! Oh! We want the appropriate noises. This is crazy! <laughs> this is Sorry. me! Look at this. Oh my gosh. What so, is that? So, I'm going to tell you everything because I know. What this. is that? What is that? She starts pointing at everything. Is this Look electric? Up. Yeah. So, oh my gosh. Fully electric. Look at these lights. It's not even And look symmetrical. at the front grill. Yeah, exactly. I love that. It's asymmetrical. Is it's like the, the first car of the yes, it's like the opposite of symmetrical, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's necessary. Can I take a selfie with it? <laughs> Again. Very good. <laughs> this side of the car is for driving, okay? So if you want to have like the wind in the hair kind of experience, yeah. ex uh, accelerating 0, 103.7 seconds, 1400 horsepower around the track, that's the side that you go in, right? That's driving. It reminds me of. Remember when they had those motorbikes and you have a little yes, thing on exactly, the side? Yes, exactly, the sidecar. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. what I thought of as well. It's on this side, you've got like the cocoon of silence. Let's just call it that. So if you want to be in autonomous mode, have the car drive you around, you sit in this side. So this car is made for one person? So it's made for three. Oh. One, you can sit in this side and drive yeah. if you want and have no one in here if you want, yeah, or you can, you can sit in here and have the car drive you around, yeah. right? So just open up. What is the third person doing? I'll show you. Oh my God. You ready? So this is like what? the cocoon. These are the, oh, this is the license plates we need to remove. Are we actually driving this? Yeah, we're going out. <laughs> yeah, I know. Look, the so right, many right? Look at this. I know, this is the kind of car we've got. Like, look at the crowd, it's crazy. <laughs> this is how popular it's so. Can we go up and down Knightsbridge? Let's just go for it. Yeah, on those just, headers. Yeah. <laughs> I've never been close to a car like this before. Isn't it crazy? It's and then so cool. you ask where the third chair is. It's like a floating oh. chair. 
you can see through. So it's like floating in the middle of the glass. Is that is that gonna break if it No, no, no? you can give it a good go. I'm quite heavy. So so sit in. Oh yeah, it's pretty sturdy. It's good, right? Yeah, they did a good job with the Hey, oh my god, we've got floor. matching shoes. Yeah, right? I saw you got Boom. them. <laughs> I saw you got them new, so I bought them. Oh, yeah. Everything you, you promote, I You just had to one on me, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. that's it. <laughs> you can either have your mate drive you yeah. and sit here, or you can have the car drive itself. How does that work? Well, it's autonomous. So it'll drive itself. Wow. Mind blown. Mind blown. Yeah. Oh my it's god. Got, it's got a coffee machine. Wow. So you can just sit there as a passenger, chill and have a coffee. When I have a coffee, it usually gives me a runny tummy. Okay, then let's so not do, do that. that yeah. Yeah? But Cause... this has got a nice, smooth ride, so I might be able to. Uh, yeah, no, don't. Okay. Just, let's just see. <laughs> it's not no, risky. cancel that. Right. Cancel that. Right. No coffee. Because okay. you can't really get out of this very quickly. You know, yeah. it's the cocoon of silence. Oh, you're gonna close Even if in? you scream for the toilet, I won't be able to hear you. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like the undertaker, or the opposite. I feel like so, the person the undertaker's taken. So, how do you feel about this? I I'm feel... going gonna... to drive you. Yeah. And I want you to get like the cocoon experience. Okay. Come look at this. <laughs> I've taken over the presenter yeah. role. Guys, come That's look at fine, this. I'll tell you what, now. this car's my favourite. Is that how you speak? That was pretty good actually. And he's got blonde hair, so yeah. I'm out. I'm, I'm done. See you later guys. Yeah. She's channel now. So back to Supercar Blondie. That was pretty bad, but <laughs> I'll give it to you. Alright, Casper cam time. We're about to get in. Oh, wow. Wow. So, I'm in the cocoon. I'm ready to become a butterfly. Because right now, I'm a... What, what is it before you're a butterfly? Do you know how to get out? Like, uh, you just pull okay. this one, okay? Wow, just okay. Just if you need to get out. I need to jump out if yeah, I have just, some of the coffee. You have to do a rolling jump. Okay, I'm not going to stop for you. You okay. just have to... Can I actually... I can't believe I can have coffee in here. No, well, I won't do it. You kind of can, but okay. you can't really. Do you All know right. what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's kind of concept coffee. Oh, yeah. I, see. <laughs> I see. All right, okay, so um, okay. good luck, yeah? Thank you. Wow. Oh! That's everyone's dream is to be put into a cocoon by a supercar blondie. You can hear me, right? There we go. It's time to turn into a butterfly. Wow. Look at this. Everywhere you go, people are watching. And look at that underneath the floor. Oh, it's a reflection of me right now, but I can see the floor. Uh, it's gravel. But if it changes, I'll tell you. All right. How's it going? Can you hear me? I can hear you. Can't okay. You? It's going to get loud though. Yeah, I won't be able to hear you from now on. Okay. Oh, the new iPhone. Baller. Are you ready? I practiced my Queen's wave. <laughs> seatbelt? Do you have a seatbelt? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta do it. It's gonna be done. Are you going past Buckingham Palace? Huh? Are you going to Buckingham Palace? Yes. Cool. The Queen. the Queen. Yes. Oh my gosh. Oh! Alrighty. Okay, are you sure you know how to drive this car properly? No. Okay. Now. Okay. Oh my gosh. What? Look at that. Look at the floor. Come on, stop showing my reflection. That's the floor right there. Whoa! You look like a Bond villain. Wow. Wow. What's it like in there? I love it. Can you, is there a breeze or anything? Not at all. I feel like I'm in a cocoon. Oh God. Um. <laughs> Look at everyone's reactions. Oh my god, they love it. I don't know if they're looking at you or the car. I feel like you're in my side car. <laughs> Look. She's just like, what? Hey ladies. <laughs> they didn't even look up. They're not impressed by No, they're, 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 they're trying to make too much money. Look at him, he loves it. What do you think, buddy? Wave! Look, she's smiling. Good, huh? Woo! This is mental! Is this what it's like to be an Instagram car reviewer? You always get this kind of experience. I'm gonna start a car channel. Is this the most expensive car in the world? Um, we'll see. 
you'll know once someone buys it how much they pay for it. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, this is relaxing. Oh, uh, you know, this is what life is all about, huh? Wow. I'm just chilling in London with Alex. Feet up. Just relaxing. She's having the best time of her life hanging out with me. And, uh, you know, I'm just happy I can be around for her. This is great. Oh, wow, look at the floor! Look at the floor! Oh, my lord! It's loud. It's loud and proud. I haven't seen it. Have you not seen the floor? Um, oh, my lord. Look at that. That's the floor. I've peaked. I've peaked. At the age of 25. Yeah, it's a quarter of life crisis. Like you peed. No, peaked. <laughs> yeah, no. I either peed or I peed. I hope I peed rather than peaked. Look at that. Oh, I really want a coffee. This is the future. Who said electric cars couldn't be fun? Look at these people running. Oh my lord, are they running for us? No, they're not. Oh, wow. Uh... <laughs> it's moments like these, eh? I just want to pinch myself. Never in a million years did I think Alex would drive a car with me in the passenger seat. Wow, we're going past Buckingham Palace. This is crazy. Hi! Great. Look, I I feel like I've cheated on my girlfriend with a car. You don't miss um, it, have you? Yeah, no, I nearly had a coffee. I, I didn't do anything. I did put my feet up there, so you might not sell it for as much money. That's but, okay. Uh, I'll just clean you it up. the value you to it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we, should, we should grab a photo. How was that? That was. That was, was insane. Insane. What, what was, was it? Okay. Okay. Oh, I mean, oh, I'd wait, love to. Someone press the brake. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so, so much for watching. Give the video a quick thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Check out Casper's channel yes, too. Yes, please. It is, the link is in the description just below the video. Right, thank you so, so much so for So I get to out. drive, yeah? Oh, yeah. Thank you so much to the DS Automobiles team for bringing this car out to London for us to be able to drive around today. That is amazing. We cannot wait to see what you have in store for us next. See you guys soon. Bye, guys. I'm out. Bye.